taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lightsaber back with another video guys. We're going to talk about a meme coin on Arbitrum. This is actually the second Arbitrum token that I've covered, right? However, I did take the previous video down. Some of you might have asked why I took down the video for Arb Enu, right? It's a meme coin on Arbitrum. The main reason I took it down is at the time I recorded the video, I actually bought it around that price and I thought it was a good place to buy, but then I actually changed my mind after I uploaded the video and I thought, you know what, I got a little bit scared, I thought I was buying the top. So I actually came out of that token and I felt it necessary to take the video down because I didn't want to mislead anybody based on what I said in the video that I was actually holding that token. Okay guys, so nothing wrong with the project or anything like that still looks like a pretty bullish project however i just felt like my entry was at the top and i didn't want to get wrecked and i didn't want anyone else to get wrecked so uh i just wanted to put that out there but um one of the main reasons why i'm buying tokens on arbitrum right is for the simple fact that there could be an airdrop on arbitrum right if you're bridging on arbitrum if you're buying or selling tokens because there's not a token for arbitrum yet yeah it's an eth scaling solution layer two on ethereum right and um you know i got an airdrop on optimism pretty decent airdrop didn't get the aptos one because i didn't mess around on the test net but um you know i think that you know if arbitrum does an airdrop i could potentially make myself eligible for that by using the arbitrum network okay guys not only that but the fees are cheap cheaper than on ethereum so mitchell's versus the jeets looks like a pretty decent project i have spoken to one of the devs who i've worked with before okay guys and you know i can vouch for him he's legit to me at least one of the devs on this project is legit as far as i'm aware as far as, in my opinion right and the project looks actually decent the tokenomics are pretty unique okay guys they've got some uh holdenomics should i say um you know some pumponomics let's say pumponomics uh, by holding these tokens you actually get rewarded in other tokens okay so they've got five tokens in this ecosystem at the moment there's only one so the first token is this token, Rick M. Okay, guys, you're going to look at this and you're going to think, yo, it's proper low market cap at 4.69K, but the liquidity matches the market cap. A lot of times you'll see tokens that are like a million market cap and have only got like 12K liquidity, right? This one is 4.69K market cap, according to the sushi pool. And the total liquidity is 5.56K. All right, guys. So it is super degen. There is potential for this to pump like i said it's on the arbitrum network okay guys now in order to get rewarded in the new tokens which we'll read through how it works in a minute right um you need to hold at least a 0.25 percent of each token okay um so starting with the rick m token i worked it out at around it's between a 10 and a hundred dollars feel free to correct me in the comments all right guys but it's super low a super low amount at current prices that you need to hold in order to qualify for the new tokens right but if you do qualify for those new tokens you're going to be in from the ground floor because you get airdrop them right and this particular token at the beginning done 614 percent of course it's had a bit of a sell-off okay guys this is literally only a few hours old by the way but it's had a bit of a sell-off which is natural okay um but there's potential for this to pump especially if they roll out the marketing on this token all right, guys. Um, yeah, so if you want to buy uh, to coins on Arbitrum, right, you go over to chainlist.org. First of all, type in Arb, right, or Arbitrum. Add the Arbitrum 1 network to your MetaMask. This is the correct one you need. Okay, guys, add that to your MetaMask. And then basically you just send Ethereum to your uh, Arbitrum network. I did it. I didn't bridge, right? I just do it on Binance because I've got money on Binance. I just send a bit of Ethereum, uh, withdraw it through the Arbitrum network to my MetaMask, and there I can transact using Ethereum on Uniswap or SushiSwap. Uh, this one is on SushiSwap. Okay, guys, so you will need to buy this on SushiSwap if you are interested in accumulating this token. Okay, so first of all, go over to chainlist.org, add that to your MetaMask, and then, you know, use SushiSwap or or uh, to buy on to buy this token or you can use uniswap for various other tokens as well wherever the liquidity pool is bigger okay guys but the mitchells is if you haven't seen this right this is basically an animation on netflix or one of the channels basically an animation i've actually seen um <laughs> you know i've actually seen it yeah but um basically there's a token attached to each one of these characters 
okay guys and they all have different tokenomics different use cases okay but you're going to earn free tokens like i said by holding 0.25 percent of the total supply of those tokens and like i said um the supply or sorry the amount that you need to put in to get that okay which is called hodler rewards or holder rewards right is just 0.25 percent okay so with the first token rick m okay now the supply on this is 10 billion tokens okay guys so you need to earn you need to have 250 million tokens 0.25 percent of the supply in order to earn an airdrop in the next token okay which will be the generous mother linda token okay guys but remember there is a three percent tax when you're buying these tokens um sorry there's a six percent buy and sell tax sorry uh so you need to uh um you know it's three percent uh well, 6%, 6% buy and sell tax, okay, guys, and you need to uh, take that into account when you're buying, okay, so however much you need to, uh, you need to, to, to hold, of course, that, that tax, you might need to bump it up a little bit because of the tax, okay, the next token has 10 billion supply as well, so similar tokenomics, and then the following tokens have, sorry, the third token also has 10 billion supply, and then the following tokens have slightly lower supply, this one at 1 million, and then the final token at 10 million, okay, guys, so, um, yeah, it's a pretty interesting project, pretty interesting tokenomics, I haven't actually joined the Telegram yet, I was looking for the Telegram link, so I'm going to join that, okay, guys, I'm going to link it in the description for you as well, and do I need to verify so I don't get kicked, probably not, okay guys but yeah like i said i will leave the link in the description for you they also have a twitter i, I was actually looking for a telegram up here because i saw the twitter link over here right but i couldn't find a telegram link just by hovering over i saw the twitter link here okay guys so i've since followed them on twitter um which is very you know it's, it's literally a brand new project all right guys so you know looking at the potential for it you know if it goes nuts um, but like I said, this is a sponsored video. So of course, do your own research. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. I think, you know, uh, it, it could be a good project, uh, but only time will tell. And Arbitrum is not uh, familiar. Everyone's not familiar with Arbitrum. Okay, but it is quite popular in my Telegram group, I've noticed. So I'm actually in on the Arbitrum action now as well. All right, guys, I'm going to leave all the links in the description. Let me know what you think in the comments, guys. Does this look like a project for you? For me, the website looks actually pretty good. All right, which I forgot to mention. It looks pretty decent. Let me know what you think in the comments as well, guys. But that's about it for this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tick the little bell for notifications, guys. And I will see you in the very next one.